Well, you asked for a response. You got a response. No, no, I'm obviously absolutely delighted. I think, um, you know, we were, we were short last week, but I did feel there was quite a lot of, and, and it's not guided at you personally. I think within the whole city, I thought there was a lot of negativity and even coming here today, I, I just felt people were apprehensive and that's one poor performance mm. in since January the 1st of yep. this year and uh, I just think people have got to be a bit more realistic and uh, you know get behind us when we need them. But mm. uh, I, I felt that crowd that didn't, didn't make us feel nervous but um, I'm delighted for the players because you know they're, they're a very very honest group and um, you know, that, that's what they were all about today and I, and I think they were worthy of the win. And really I did say to them you know before the game of the day that the ones that have stayed in there our performance to the ones mm. that got left out because everyone could have probably yeah. bitten a bullet. But you know, uh, but I think what, what we have to be realistic and, and look at is that it was one one bad performance really. And, and it, but you know, I, I still feel that again today with, with what we have missing, it, it's phenomenal. We're four points off the top of the league. We've got six proper players to come mm. back, and they'll be back by January, and that'd be like six new signings that I don't think any other club be doing what we were doing right now and I think that's where we've got to remain really positive and, and, and believe, mm. really do because I think it's, it it's really is remarkable of what this group has achieved. You must be pleased with the manner of the victory, it was, I mean it was comfortable, there was no part of the game where you didn't look like you were in control of it. No, I thought that a real turning moment was, you know, I think Ishmael made a real good interception in front of the goal down here to our left uh, and we broke and scored. Mm. And then I think from there, you know, you could see the players were lifted, the crowd, and and like we do here, the you know, crowd get behind us, the players take that on, and I thought we played off the front foot, and you know we could have had a couple of more goals today. I spoke with the players behind closed doors all week, uh, and then we remain behind closed doors. That yeah, there were certain issues, and, I, and I, not not excuses. There were reasons uh, for for the lack of performance last week, but. I think, as we always know with this group, they're very resilient and they're very together. And uh, you know, they love playing for this football club. And uh, you know, I think everyone goes away here today knowing you know, what we're all about. It's a game of opinions, and it's a game where you're always about the collective, not the individual. But two places that I thought really stood out today, two that came in, Ryan Jackson and Tom Naylor. Yeah, I thought, you know, big games for them, but both been waiting patiently. And you know, I thought big for Tom because. As his first start since you know he had the uh, mishap here against Morecambe, and, and I thought he marshalled that midfield very well. But yeah, I thought Ryan was a was a threat going forward and defended really well today. And I'm pleased because I think what we know is it's going to be about a squad. Um, and I've always stated I think that we have we have a very good squad. That I feel that each and every one of them probably feel that um, you know that they, they should play. And I, and I think a special mention is to the three boys that come on. You know, Flinny, Crowy, and Robbie quite easy to drop their heads and, and, and felt, you know, criticism was pointed at just them because they were left out, but I thought that they were, uh, they were excellent as well. So I think all in all we've had, we've had a fantastic response and a, and a great result. You're of the opinion formations are a bit overrated, or overstated perhaps is a better way of putting it. Perhaps we saw that today, you went to 5-3-2, then the change, you went to 4 and it, you know, the dominance didn't change. No, I think we, I think we can. You can as a manager, and a couple of times in this season, I'm learning. I'm learning. I, I, you know, sometimes we, we, for 15 minutes out here today, we, you know, we was under pressure. But I think we've got to learn that we're a step higher, and we're playing against better players. And every team will have a period in the game, um, and we have to, you know, we have to know how to deal with that. Um, but yeah, no, I think, you know, it wasn't about formation. It was about. A, a desire and, and, a, and a, maybe a little point to prove to ourselves mm. today.